I'm Adam Biggers of ScoutSpy.com, and I'm here with Montrose Rams football coach Dennis Reinhardt. Coach, uh, I heard you say earlier it was, a, it was a shame that someone had to lose this game. It was hard fought, 22-21. You guys it just kind of scraped and clawed your way. Just talk about feeling winning the GAC title and beating a quality team like Lake Fenton. Well, we knew coming in it was going to be a war, and uh, with a little situation, we prepared the kids for that. Uh, you know, it was one of the things where uh, we dominated the first half, they dominated the second half, and second half and we hung on by our teeth right at the end of regulation and uh, got into overtime and you know, I thought we had a one with the, the, the field goal and missed it but uh, you know, obviously down in the situation here we score the touchdown they score and go for two somebody's gonna win somebody's gonna lose and uh, you know we were fortunate enough to win but that's why I said it's a shame that one of these two teams had to lose but you know that's that's athletic somebody's got to win somebody's got to lose but uh, you know obviously you know we feel great that was us winning but it's a shame that somebody had to lose this how do you approach a team that scores 52 a game and gives up nine we were concerned, obviously. I, nobody slowed them down, not a little stop them. So we weren't going to try to stop them. We didn't think we could stop them. We were going to try to slow them down. And the way to slow them down, we were trying to control the ball. And we were doing that in the first half, and then uh, Caleb uh, you know, got a high ankle sprain and was playing at 50%. You know, and then it really took some of the things away from us and it forced us to do some other things, and we made some bad uh, decisions and that sort of stuff. But that's a lot of pressure put on some high school kids. But uh, we hung tough and stayed with it, and, and obviously we got the outcome. It looks like tonight you guys play a classic Montrose football, just a ground and pound, hard nose making big plays when you had to. If you could just tell me the feeling right now, seeing, seeing you guys in the overtime come up with that stop on fourth down, it was do or die right there. It was do or die, and I'm just, I'm just so proud of these kids. I mean, they played their hearts out and left it on the field, and uh, to come away like that against you know their offense, going for two at the end of the game, and then be able to stop them. Like I said, nobody stopped them all year, and uh, we were fortunate to be able to do it there, and uh, you know what a great way to win the game. Excellent. I appreciate your time, Coach. Good luck the rest of the way. Thank you very much.